Hey everyone, this is Kinda Gamer here, and I am back with part 29 of my Let's Play of Spyro 3 Reignited. And in this part, we are going to be heading into Harbor Speedway. Let's go. I think this is the last level before we go into the final boss, which will be the sorceress herself. So I'm looking forward to seeing how this, uh, how the rest of this unfolds. And if we're lucky, we may possibly get this game finished today when I'm recording this. So let's find out and see how it goes. Blue food boobies. Hmm. Right, we'll go for the time attack first. So seagulls, archers, lobsters and fish, well, I'll try to keep that order in mind, but I, knowing me and uh, how these speedway levels go, I'm probably not going to do very well, but we'll see. We'll see, you never know. Shouldn't doubt myself too much. So seagulls... Almost done with them. So seagulls, then there was archers next. Then it's the these lobsters next. And then after that it's the fish. Okay. Oh god, this might be a little bit tricky. Oh did I get that one? I think I did. Yeah, I got him. Oh, nice! Okay, that was really easy, actually. Wow, first try. That rarely ever happens. So, okay, we're not going to do that again, because we're not going for any records or anything. So we've got Kobe. Cool, cool nice. Or Kobe. We'll race the blue fruit boobies next. Alright, let's go. Another race. So let's uh, find out and see how this goes. I use the blue stars to get a good uh, boost there. Make sure I fly through all the rings as well. Should be another blue star here. Yep. I can't even hit them, can I? And I'm still in 6th place, oh dear, this is not looking good. Get that one there. I don't know if I, um... Oh, I must have, very right, okay, good. I was about to say, I don't know if I flew through that green room properly, but thankfully I did. Alright, now it's time to get that missile. Shoot them down there, they're slowing down a bit. So far I've only seen one of those red stars, I haven't seen any of the other ones. Oh actually, that's a good shortcut down there that I could take there. 
because there's no other green rings to fly through, so I might as well just use that then. And I could probably take a risk maybe by flying down there to get that missile, but then again, even if I do, I'm probably going to end up uh, not... <clears throat> I may end up falling in the water by mistake. Oh, there's another one. There we go. Oh, another one. Get that there. Oh, find them. Maybe not then. It was a bit too high to fly for that last blue star. Right, let's see if I can get all the blue stars I can. Because I'm on the last lap here. I'm probably not going to succeed at this first try, but we'll see how it goes. Right, stay down here. Oh wow, holy hell. That was good. Managed to actually smash into one of the uh, the blue food boobies there. Using the speed. Oh god. No. Oh. Okay, right, that was close. Yeah, I think it's safe to say that I haven't got this. I was so tempted to cheat there, but I think the game would have disqualified me there for that, so no. There was no way. They wouldn't have accepted that. Yeah. Never mind. Third place, okay. No, we're, we'll try that again, right? I'll be right back as soon as I finish this race. Here we go again. Third try on this one because I ended up failing the second time there because I missed one of the green hoops. Did I miss that missile? Really? Oh, that, that kind of sucks. Right, okay. Blue stars. One, two, three, four. They're good. Flame them so I can get in front. Probably should have flown below there as well, never mind. Alright, good, I'm up to fourth, and I'm on the second lap. Get that missile, there we go. Slow him down there. Nice. Way ahead of the, the fourth place now. Oh, right, okay, that, that scared me, but I actually thought I missed a green hoop there, but it was just a blue star. That's fine. So I'm in second place right now, so we'll see if I can catch up to first here. Should be able to do so in this last lap here. If I don't catch up to first place, that's going to be a damn shame. Far behind. If I maybe use these. Is he using all four of them? Yeah, probably is. Yeah. It's okay though, we'll see if I can catch up. Oh my goodness. Okay, good. Right, that was a bit too close. I think I might have it this time. Third try. Third time being the charm. Oh no, my god, no. Don't you dare overtake me. I swear. If he overtakes me now, I'm going to be really mad. Oh, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Good. Finally did it. I mean, that I can actually believe. So, Jesse is the next track in the rescue. Nice. Thank you, 
I'll go for the time attack again, but this time I'm going to go and find Hunter. And if I remember correctly, I think Hunter is at the lighthouse area, so if I fly over here and drop down here... Where is he? There he is. Nice. Where do these flying sheep saucers keep coming from? I just saw another one grab an egg and Got another fly trophy off. there. This one's super fast, but his saucer is damaged and it's leaving smoke rings. I think I can keep up with them as long as I can make it through those rings. I'm gonna chase him down. Should Hunter chase a sheep UFO? Yeah, well, hurry up, let's go then. Right back. All right, let's see how this goes. So I've got to fly through the smoke rings. All right, let's see how how difficult this one's going to be. Knowing my luck, this is probably going to be very, very difficult. Yeah, I can't do anything. I just have to try and just uh, keep up with them, and eventually I'll get them. Very close to him already, wow. Oh no, I missed it! God damn it! Where are these? Okay. Oh, god damn it, I hate when that happens, like when you're so close. When you're so close to the, the UFO and then all of a sudden he throws one out right at you when you're not expecting it. At least if I remember the pattern anyway, I should be able to go. Unless it, it better not be different every time. If it's different every time, that I think we're going to be here for a while. Okay. Just keep following that UFO. Oh no! Oh, that's not good. That isn't good at all. I think I failed this. Because I ended up getting delayed there. Okay, good, right, I, I made it. Thank goodness. Yes! That was close. The egg popped out just before the saucer crash landed. And I rescued uh, Sarah. Nice. All right, we got all the eggs there. Nice. I think that's it, isn't it? We'll um, we'll go for the time attack just so I can see if I've got. Yeah. Okay, so it is all 100% rare. Right. We're gonna quit then. I'm gonna leave. Yeah, Harbor Speedway is pretty cool, actually. Now that I think about it, it's it's pretty cool. And now that I've played through all the Speedway levels, I have to say, out of all the Speedway levels in the trilogy, I have to say Spyro 3's ones are the best. Because the Time Attack ones are the, the better ones, because at least um, you're not under pressure to get all of the collectibles that give you more time. At least the, the time overall is there. And um, for you to get all the items, so you're not as pressurised as much. I actually like that better than the other one, honestly. So looking at the time of this video so far, I think we've got enough time to do the boss. So I might as well just go for it. So where is the final boss? Through here. I think it's through here. Yep, here we go. Sorceress's lair. Here we go. Let's do this. Final boss time. Looking forward to seeing how this unfolds. There she is. So, what do we do here for this one, though? She's got the dragon egg on the their staff there. Okay, she's got those attacks. Right. Whoa, God. Okay, that's a... 
don't know if that's a homing one. Oh, what's this? If I maybe... Can I lure her to get those... Oh no. Not good. Oh, nice. Okay, so we use those cannons to, to damage her, right? Okay, I get it. And then again, I got very bad aiming, so I got her once. Better than not hitting her whatsoever, but I could have hit her way more than... way more than that. So how do you activate the cannons, then? Oh, do you just jump on the... Oh, crap, right, okay. Do you just... Oh, you just jump in them? Okay. Oh god, she's gonna try and squash me. Right, there we go. This better not be like Gulp from Spyro 2. <laughs> For those who know what I'm talking about when it came to No Harm Done, when I did Spyro 2 from No Harm Done Episode 46, the sheer difficulty I had with that one. Come on. Okay, right. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have gone up that close to her. Right, fair enough. My bad then. Right. Maybe just avoid those projectiles. No, don't be there. Oh no, you don't. Oh no. Haha, <laughs> alright. She's still failing to hurt me, even with me going so slow there. <laughs> really? Ripto's much better than you. Oh my god. Can I jump off that? Yeah, I'm going to have to jump off that. There's no way I'm going to be able to hit her there. Well, so far I have to say, I think this is easier than, than Ripto. I will say that. Okay, nice. Got her done almost halfway, or more than halfway for her health. No, you don't. can't be all she's going to do. This seems a bit e too easy for a final boss. Oh, what's this? Oh, okay, this is a... Oh my god, okay, the controls on this, right? Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my god, what the hell was that? Okay, yeah, the con... Okay, the controls on that one are a bit too... Okay, good. They're throwing the sheep down, thank goodness, right. I can get that sheep so I can get more sparks health, that'd be great. No! Oh no! That isn't good. Not good at all. Okay, thank goodness I ran right into another sheep without realising it, that's good. Okay, so we got a spaceship weapon. Yeah, that one there. Yeah, that's, that weapon there is not very good, I'm going to be honest there. Although the controls for that are a bit... Are, what the hell? Okay, that is really weird. I ran away from her all the time like that, and she never hit me like that. Okay, this is getting really intense, right? Come on, get that. There we go. This is getting extremely intense. No. Okay, good. You see, I always ran away from her and she never caught up to me. But that one time I think she got very lucky. I just... Oh, god damn it. No good. Yeah, this is much easier already than the Ripto, I'm going to be honest here. Yes, I've almost died on a couple of occasions, but with Ripto, it's very easy to, to die on that one. 
Okay. Whoa. Okay, I'm gonna jump off that because the controls for that spaceship or that hovercraft are pretty terrible. From what I'm experiencing on that anyway. Right. Final hit. Where is it? There we go. Gordon. Nice. Sorcerer is down. And that's a gold trophy there as well. Very good. And the last egg that I got there is George. But I don't think it's the last egg entirely. Very nice. I think we've got the ending coming up right here. Spyro, you've just defeated the sorceress, rescued the dragon eggs, and restored freedom to the lost dragon worlds. What do you plan to do next, hmm? Perhaps a nice vacation in Dragon Shores, hmm? <laughs> You're a real comedian sometimes, Bentley. <laughs> you know, I still have to find the rest of the dragon eggs. Plus, Hunter seems to have disappeared again, so I should go make sure he's not in more trouble. You haven't seen him, have you? What? Me? Oh, uh, no, no. <laughs> if, uh, if I do happen to encounter him, however, I will most certainly inform you immediately. Hmm. Yeah, Spyro thinks uh, there's something up there. Thing, Spyro. I adjusted Avalar's portals to take me to the Oh, Lord is back. But somehow I ended up here. Uh, maybe my coordinate tables are out of date. Yeah, by a thousand years. That would explain why the book was so cheap. So, now that you're done saving the world again, are you going to visit me in Avalar? Sure, Laura, but I still have to find the rest of the eggs, and, well, Hunter's disappeared again. What did you say? Hunter? No, hey, I can help. I just saw him sneak off with him. Agent 9, isn't that a Rhinoch over in those bushes? A Rhinoch? Ooh, let me at him. You want a piece of me, Rhinoch boy? Eight laser punk? Come on now. No fair hiding. Hey, I'm sure Hunter is in good hands. <laughs> uh, I mean, I'm sure he will turn up soon. Promise you'll come visit Avalar soon, okay? <laughs> yeah, they all know what's going on with Hunter. It was Billy's idea. Yeah, yeah. Is that true, Billy? <laughs> Hold that thought, Billy. Spyro, great to see ya. Hi, Sheila. I've been looking for Hunter all day. Have you seen him? <laughs> Sorry, Spyro. Hunter made me promise not to tell you where they went. They? <laughs> you didn't hear anything from me. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> of course. <laughs> It's a sad sight, Sparks. Another noble warrior falls victim to the plague of love. Just look away. Well, I guess we'll have to find the rest of the eggs by ourselves. Come on, Spyro. Take a little break. Let's watch the show. I find that kind of ironic that Spyro's talking about another noble warrior falls victim to the plague of love. And yet all of a sudden, like, uh, Alora shows up. <laughs> Again. To watch the fireworks show with Spyro, just like, um, just like uh, Bianca and uh, Hunter. So, yeah. Kind of ironic there. <laughs> anyway, we're going to skip these credits. So we got another dragon egg in our hands. But we're not done yet. There's more stuff to go, which I'm going to do in the next part, unless if anything else happens here. Let's find out. Oh, these loading times are so long. <laughs> I think I've played the the Spyro on the PS5 and the loading times there are slightly more better. Oh, there we go. Alright, so... 
Oh, might as well get another extra life and get Sparks back to full health there. Even though I never lost a, another life there, Agent Nine's lab. There's got to be. What else is there? Oh, hello, Mr. Sleazebags. What are you doing here on that bridge? Oh, I thought I could surprise him. <laughs> don't worry, Spyro. I won't be needing any more of your money. Now, now, don't look so surprised. I found one of the dragon eggs, and I'm going to sell it for a fortune back at Avalar. Uh, uh oh. Why are you looking at me like that? Mm -mm. I, uh, <laughs> I've got to be going now. Toodles! Bad idea, Mr. Moneybags, aka Sleaze Bags. You're gonna get it now. Oh god, don't fall. Oh my god. Spider, what are you doing? It's like he didn't want to get the dragon egg back. Come on, Spyro, you want to get that dragon egg back? And I'm going to get all of my money back as well. <laughs> this is so goddamn satisfying. Okay, wait, where the hell is he? Oh, he's over there, right. Keep flaming him, and I'll get all the gems back that I lost. This is so satisfying. <laughs> Brilliant. God, I keep forgetting how much how much gems did he make me pay there? I'm getting so many off of him. Nothing satisfying more satisfying about chasing money bags around and getting all the gems back as well as getting the dragon egg, of course. I think if I remember correctly, it's 15,000 is the total amount of gems, isn't it? Yep, I think it's 15,000. So a few more times. Ah, oh, there we go, got him. Nice. Double drat. Drat, 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 drat. I never knew dragons were so fast. That's it. I give up. I'm retiring to Spooky Swamp to become a haiku poet. Nice. And I rescued Al. Don't worry, Al, you're safe with me now. Oh. I wanted to get him some more. Never mind. He's fled the Crystal Islands for some reason. He's retiring to become a haiku poet. Well, good luck with that, Mr. Moneybags. Don't know if we're ever going to see him again in the future Spyro game in Spyro 4, possibly, I'm not sure. So anyway, next time I come back, I will be going to the Sparks level, and then we'll see what happens after that. Because I believe there is another level to go to, but I can't remember where it is again. As a matter of fact, is it over there actually? It might be over there. I think I may have to glide over to it though, but anyway, I'll worry about that for the next part. So anyway, I want to thank you all very much for watching part 29 of uh, Let's Play Spyro 3 Reignited, and I'll see you next time for the final part of the Let's Play, which will be part 30, which is 30 parts for Spyro 3, quite fitting actually for that one. But anyway, I'll see you again next time for that, and I uh, hope you all take care, and I uh, hope you have a good day. See you again soon. Bye-bye.